Hey, what's going on guys? Swanee here. Welcome back to LSPDFR. This is episode number three. Uh, today we're going to be up in uh, Polito Bay doing some sheriff work up here. Uh, I think I did fix... We have a 1099 in Polito Bay. Alright, we'll ignore that for now. But uh, I did fix the game from before. Uh, it was kind of uh, glitchy the last time we played. Uh, and I, I added some more add-ons that might have stabilized the game a little bit. So anyway, uh, that's good to know. I've just been kind of uh, trying to switch it up a little bit. So we're going to get back up here to the to the you know to the north side of the map, get some sheriff work in instead of uh, our police work. And uh, we'll kind of see what uh, what comes up. All right, so we're just, it's been a little bit slow today. So we're just going to kind of pull off to the side here, keep our radar out, just make sure no one's speeding or uh, there's no flags of like stolen vehicles or expired licenses and stuff like that. So... Uh, we're just going to kind of hang out here for a sec, and uh, we'll, we'll see if uh, anything pops up. We have a person shooting at animals in uh, Palato Bay. Respond code 2. Alright, uh, just got a report of someone possibly uh, hunting illegally. We're going to go ahead and head over there and check it out. Uh, they want us to respond code 2, so we're not going to put these sirens on. We'll just kind of roll over there. Uh, we don't want to, you know, uh, spook the guy out or uh, let him know we're coming. Sorry, dude, you're gonna be like, who's gonna have to wait? This is part of the new callouts I got. This is a uh, wilderness callouts. Uh, I forget who makes it, but uh, I can link it in the description if you guys want to check it out. Uh, it's kind of has a bunch of callouts for this area of the map. All right, looks like we're approaching up here. Let's uh, let's see what's going on. Oh, we got a truck blocking the way. There's a guy with a gun. I'm not sure what's going on here. We're definitely going to uh, call for some backup here. Attention all units. We have an officer in need we'll wait till the guy comes. I don't know what we're... Uh, I can't tell if that's a person or an animal. Uh, I don't want to engage him. He's, looks like he's got a rifle. Oh my goodness. Come on, dude. Hurry up. All right. Let's go, uh, let's go talk to this dude. See what's going on. That's definitely a person. Oh my god, he just shot a monkey! Dude! Why is there a- first of all, why is there a monkey out here? It's a little interesting. He's part of the biker gang. Alright, so it wants us to ask for the hunting license to see if this guy's obviously hunting legally, which he's definitely not. So we'll press it. Do you have a hunting license? It's right here. All right, it's valid. Um, I I guess we let him leave. That's kind of interesting. All right. Uh, go ahead, dude. That's a little interesting. I don't really know what to do on that. I guess if it's illegal, you just gotta let him go, or...? Alright, well... I don't know, should I call a corner for this thing? It's probably the right thing to do. Alright, ladies, stand down, he's all good. Alright, well, she's gonna keep doing her thing, that's alright. We'll wait for the corner, they're showing up right now. I just don't get how there's a freaking monkey in the in the forest. That doesn't really make sense. Anyway, all right. Well, that's gonna do it for that call out. That was an interesting one. That was the first time I've seen that. So I was kind of expecting like a shootout or something because that guy had a gun. But uh... anyway. Uh, Alright, we'll take that. Uh, I need to... F Let's pull over here for a second. Oh my god, that guy just ran over. Alright, well I'm gonna look at this call real fast. Let's see what's going on with this call.
Uh, Mojito Inn states that a member of the public is causing a disturbance. Okay, so we'll go over there and check it out. Uh, it's probably not that big of a deal. Uh, so we'll go ahead and roll over there. Code 2. Oh, a little slippery. It's right, just right up here. Here's the end right here. We'll go ahead and pull over. Attention all units. Officers are at oh, what the hell is going on here? Is that a, is that a prostitute? All right, let's go figure this out. I don't know what's going on with this chick. She looks drunk. Slash, she probably just screwed some dude and got a shit ton of money from him. Anyway, we'll talk to the officer first or the security guard first, see what he says. Thanks for attending. I'm the security guard here. This individual, this individual is under the influence of intoxicating substances. I'm refusing them entry at this time. I would need your help, please. I'm getting them out of here. Okay. All right. Well, we'll check this person out. It looks like they're definitely drunk, so we'll go ahead and talk to them first. Wow, this dope has really put me out of it a little. All right. Well, she's definitely on dope then. Can I go home with you? No. No. LSPD, don't make me shoot no, ya. You're not going with me. Nope. No, hold on. Get out of the car. Stop! Police! Get out of here. All right, we're definitely gonna. Uh, we'll do a drug test first. So it's the same menu, so that's all right. Let's cancel all that. Let's see what she comes back with. Negative on cocaine, positive on cannabis. Well, she said she's using dope, but maybe it's just a broken script. Let's, uh, let's breathalyze. Oops. Let's breathalyze you too. All right, you haven't been drinking, so it's definitely just the dope. Do you have anything on you? Anything that you know about? All right, nothing really on her. That's that's okay. All right, so we're not gonna arrest her. I mean, she's not really doing anything wrong. It looks like she just wants to go home. Uh, I mean, she has been smoking, but she doesn't have anything on her, so uh, I, I'm not really gonna do anything about this. I don't think it's that big of a deal, so I'm gonna call a taxi for her. Just get her out of here. All right, hold on. I gotta let her. I gotta get her a warning. Alright, so I had, to let her, I had to basically not stop her first, and then I can call a taxi for her. So I'll wait for her, there's a taxi right there, we'll let her get off. And uh, we'll call that call out. Done. Citizens reporting a vicious animal in Palato Bay. Uh, alright. Yeah, alright, we're responding to that. Got a vicious animal in the town. Probably, uh, I'm guessing it's gonna be like a mountain lion or something that came down from the mountain. Go ahead and respond to that. Don't want any of that. Don't want them attacking people. Oh yeah, there it is, right there. Get the shotgun out. Oh my god, no! Dude, that thing just came out of nowhere. I mean, it got out of the car and it was like right on top of me. All right, it's still there, so we're gonna go fuck this thing up. I'm dealing with this thing. Yeah, fuck you, cat. Four. No further units required. Dude, that thing was vicious. Alright, get a corner down here. Take care of the, the animal. And get it off the street. Yeah, 
I wasn't messing around with that thing anymore. That thing was, I think, just mauls you. It doesn't even give you a chance to like shoot it. Once it gets in like a certain range, it just jumps on top of you and automatically kills you. So I lost my hat. What the hell? All right, boys. Thanks for that. Head back over to our vehicle. All right, we just got reports of a carjacking. Uh, you can see the suspect over there, the white blip on the map. We're gonna go see if we can intercept the dude. Why is there a dude in the road? Uh. Let's go to running place real fast. Patriot uh, 26 Lima Edward Boy 605. He ran a red light, too. Yeah, we're going to pull him over. Two, six, Lincoln, Edward, boy, six, zero, five, a possible stolen vehicle. Yeah, all right. Let's get him to move up here a little bit. That's that's fine. All right, we're going to pull... Oh, fuck this guy. Shots fired, shots fired. He's down, he's down. Oh, someone's jacking a truck. Alright, we're gonna call a corner. That dude just came out. I was gonna just go approach him and he decided to pop out with uh, with this gun. I think it was definitely stolen. Significant damage to the car. Uh, I don't know if it's even drivable. I'm just gonna call a tow truck. Usually I would call a uh, insurance company and pick it up, but I don't think this thing is really drivable. There's the corner. We'll go stand out here, block the road off. Well, that's going quickly. I was kind of expecting there's going to be a chase, but uh, uh, he didn't really give me a chance to, did he? All right, guys. Appreciate all the help. Guys, okay, shot out my window. Lincoln 18. We have a traffic alert on a uh, Great Ocean Highway right. for possession of drugs for sale. Uh, we got some drug runners up here. We're going to go check out. Uh, we got a hit from our AMPR. We're going to go ahead and go check them out. They're up in the mountains again. I don't, don't want to keep chasing these guys in the mountains. All right, they're down on the highway now. We're going to get some backup in here. Backup needed on a uh, Great Ocean Highway. Let's get one more unit. All units, assistance required on Great Ocean Highway. This can get dangerous pretty quickly. It's a little wet out, so we have to be careful with our driving. Make sure that he's not endangering other people. Uh, one of the new add-ons I did install was actually... Uh, Automatic roadblocks, so we're gonna use that here. Now, what that does is it just kind of figures out our path of where we're moving, and then it puts an automatic roadblock in front of us, which attempts to stop these guys. Man, I have to. This guy's. This guy's definitely moving slow. I'd want to box him in, probably. Got a roadblock in front of us. We'll just let, see if he, what happens when he gets up to this roadblock. And if he gets past him, we'll, uh... A bike and a car. More drugs right there. Alright, he definitely got past that one. Alright, we're gonna catch back up to him. Those guys are faster than me, so I'll let them take the lead.
check in front of this guy. They keep dropping drugs out the window. Let's see if I can box him in. Is that a bike? Yeah, bike couple flying. All right, we're still chasing him. We're on uh, Route 13. Headed back towards Los Santos. We got another roadblock set up in front of us. Let's see if he gets through this one or not. Yeah, he got through that one. He got through that one. Come on, guys. You need better than that. There's only one car there. Let's see if we can catch up to this guy. Let's see if we can get out of unit in here. I'm going to request a pit on this guy. See if we can get a clearance. We are clear. All right, uh, we just got to do a batch of cars, but if we can get. It's just getting dangerous. We have a roadblock in place. We'll see if this guy stops it on this one. Let's see if we can block him in. Out of the car! Out of the car! Out of the car! Get out of the car. Did you guys fuck that shit up hard? Yes, I saw him get stuff. Unfortunately, I saw him drop stuff. I just don't know where it is. I don't want to go back. They went so far. All right, I'm not even gonna deal with these guys. Just get rid of them. We know they're guilty. Let's go ahead and get rid of this car. Roger. Oh, what are they doing now? God. There we go. I just spawned them in there. They're all over the other side of the map, so. You take this guy. They're gonna take care of that girl. Anyway, guys, that's gonna do it for this episode. Uh, I ended up with a with a pretty big chase. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, patrolling from a from a sheriff's perspective instead of the LSPD. Uh, if you guys uh, enjoyed the video, leave a thumbs up. If you want to see some more LSPD afar, make sure you subscribe and be sure to check out the channel for all the other games and sims that I play as well. So, appreciate you guys stopping by. Take care.